Tony, uh, mixed luck in the barrier draw for you. Uh, dispatch inside alley and dollar for dollar, 19. Yeah, uh, I didn't do a very good job with dollar, drawing 19, Bart, but uh, it's going to make it tough for him with his style. Uh, but the other horse drawing one is very exciting. It really gives him a chance to run the 1400 because uh, he'll just have a restful run throughout. He, he's an on-pace runner. You, you have to take advantage of that rails draw. Oh, yeah, he's quite fast. Like he's, uh, We've never had to push him forward. He's put himself there, and it, he led in the Goodwood, which was a surprise, Bart. We thought he, we mapped him sort of fifth, sixth, and getting a beautiful run, and he led, which surprised us. But but when we, did the, when we dissected the race... For a Group 1 race, they went pretty steady the first half, and uh, so he was leading, getting away with some really cheap sections and, and was able to finish strong, but I couldn't see him leading a Stradbroke. And dollar for dollar comes in in good form. Look, his form was great. The Dooman 10,000 run was outstanding, and then he had a really bad day the other day. Uh, he must have just choked down. Even though he had a tongue tie on, I used the rubber band tongue ties, maybe he was strong enough just to get it back because he just stopped. And, and I've done every test known to man Bart and uh, he's come up with a clean bill of health and his work here Tuesday was really solid and normal. So uh, I want to give him another chance. It's a good even Stradbroke field and lucky and running's probably going to play a big role. It does in most races, uh, it does, doesn't it? Uh, so, look, I, I'm, I've got Jamie Carr on dollar and I've got Baron Vorster on the other horse. They're both very fit and well. And uh, if we get that uh, elusive word you're saying, luck, we're going to be in the finish. Good luck, Tony. Thank you.